A young girl drowned yesterday. Being drowned alongside his five-year-old brother, Gallup. He'd suffered an anoxic brain injury. J.D. spent a week in intensive care. Your arms tied behind your back and your legs bound. Because, I mean, that's how it felt for me because I didn't know how to swim. When I went under the water, I just thought it was it. I... Love lifeguard died trying to save a swimmer yesterday. Magnus says Carlson's death is an ever present reminder of the dangers lifeguards face every day, risking their own lives to keep others safe. My name is Mikhail Wertheim Ames, and I'm the designer of Guardian, the life-saving drone accessory. After extensive research and training at Clifton's Life-Saving Club, I became aware of the dangers that lifeguards put themselves into on a daily basis. These are anything and everything from strong rip currents to large surf, but most of all, the danger of a person in panic. What most people don't realize is that a person in panic is unpredictable. They don't have any conscious control of their movements and the only thing they want to do is to grab onto you to stay afloat. This is where Guardian comes in. Guardian is a life-saving drone accessory that is equipped to a drone. In an emergency, the Guardian drone can be called in to deliver an inflated buoyancy aid to someone potentially drowning. I designed the system and product with regular feedback from experienced lifeguards. By combining the benefits of a torpedo buoy with those of a rescue tube, this product was truly focused towards its users' needs and more importantly, the ability to save lives. Drones can be used for good and in this particular case, this drone is fitted with a camera which can detect sharks. This drone can act autonomously and be programmed to fly waypoints while searching for the presence of sharks. At any point, this can be intervened by the pilot and be redirected to deliver a life-saving buoyancy aid to someone in distress. <laughs> 